golden age in the 1950s, but following uh, General Park Chung-hee, a uh, standing actor Song Kong-ho, who was in Parasite. So I'd like you to tell us about, uh, I'd like to say about uh, censorship. In the 1950s, the coup d'etat of Park Chung-hee, there was a very restrictive law increased and he couldn't make any films with uh, uh, any criticism, any social or political. So, selfie time, almost. So, close your eyes. Nous avons le plaisir d'accueillir l'équipe du film Cobweb dans la toile. Signé du cinéaste sud-coréen Kim. You're making fun of me. with Antonio Banderas. Films within films are often comedies. No, but I mean, Pain and Glory isn't, no, but I mean, uh, Nanny Moretti's film, uh, Fans, Song Kong Ho, on the top steps, the final way for the crowd before they go into the theater, the bad and the weird, a tale of two sisters, amongst others, and your sister, of course, did the poster. So going into the palace, it's the much-awaited moment to have this film. The film will be coming out on the 26th of July in France. A film in a film in... And we hope you have... So, hello everybody, and we're here for the photo call of Cobweb, Jul Mijip, a Korean film. A very lively cinema over the sequences of his film. He's going to be able to complete what he considers Ho, who was, of course, in Parasite, from Bong Joon-ho, another Korean film. There's Lim so Young Oh Young si Yon Yi Bing, Crystal Jung, Pok, Sun Yu. On the right, Crystal Yun, voilà, who is an actress and uh, a very well known K pop bon singer who is part of the F2X and the F2X group. So, K pop, Korean cinema go hand in hand in a way because, uh, you know, in the 1990s already. Korea wanted to breathe new life into uh, culture. They had a new cultural policy. It, uh, there was massive investment uh, in... As you know, Korean cinema had a golden age in the 50s, but following uh, Park Chun-hee's uh, overthrow of power, there was the, the whole climate but in itself, and this inspired Kim Ji-woon for his film, and this is what decided him uh, to set his film during this period of the 1970s. And popular K-pop singer in the group uh, F2X, F2X. L'actrice et chanteuse de K-pop, Crystal Jung. singer, Crystal Jung. And my question is for Crystal Jung, and I would like to know what is the biggest challenge for you starring in this movie? Um, well, every part of it was a challenge for me, but um, when I first read the script, when I just heard about the offer that was made for me, um, I just immediately knew, my instinct told me immediately that this was something that I was waiting for, something that can be a new chapter in my career. Um, so I didn't want to miss out this opportunity. And 
you know, the fact that I could get to um, collaborate with this amazing cast and crew was a must do. <laughs> so, yeah, um, I'm very grateful for that. And also, the script was very attractive. Like this, the the fact that it takes place in the 70s, and it's about the film industry in that era where there was a strict film censorship. I think that was, um, that's what fascinated me and all of the looks and everything, yeah. Thank you. We're working on this film, I thought, oh, you can be as happy working. That's what I said to myself. The environment was so kind. I'll never forget it. Once again, I would like to thank all the actors in the film. Of course, you can't focus constantly on people's faces, but as a director, I try to 